New question, Speaker. the member from Timmins, James Bay. Thank you, Speaker. My question is to the Premier. At committee, uh, later, at the committee last week, uh, we had a document that indicated that, in fact, when it came to the Oakville gas plant, that Trans Canada Credit, a uh, Trans Canada Pipeline, I should say, was in force majeure, which meant to say that you could have cancelled that gas plant without costing a nickel to the taxpayers of Ontario if you would have only taken your time and done what your ministry officials were encouraging you to do. Why didn't you do that? And why instead did you choose to do something that cost taxpayers hundreds of millions of dollars? Wow. Premier. Government House Leader. Government House Leader. Mr. Speaker. I think it's important that we go through the situation here. The city of Oakville had been trying to block the uh, had been trying to block the uh, the creation of this gas plant, Mr. Speaker. But we knew that Trans Canada was going to fight any attempts to block it, and that it was much better for us to sit down and negotiate. I'd remind Mr. Speaker of the testimony of Chris Green of Trans Canada Energy, who had this to say to the uh, committee. We were already before two different courts with what looks like about four actions, and we were before the OMB, the Ontario Municipal Board, with two appeals. We had a contractual obligation that was very cleanly spelled out in black and white that that was our responsibility. You have to go through every possible channel to deliver on your obligations in this contract, and we would have done yes, that. Sir. Mr. Speaker, we took the prudent course in negotiating with TCE in order to find an agreement on this issue. Thank you. Supplementary. You're right. The, town, the municipality of Oakville was not giving the permits necessary to allow that project to go forward. And they were in force majeure. What all you had to do to save taxpayers hundreds of millions of dollars is to, in fact, not do what you ended up doing in regards to this negotiation. So it seems to me, and it seems to most people, what you did is what Liberals are really good at. You took the interests of the Liberal Party first instead yeah. of taking the interests of the people of Ontario. So I ask you again. Why would you choose an option that cost us hundreds of millions of dollars when you could have got out of this a heck of a lot cheaper if not having to spend anything at all?